Hi Shakespeare's, hi YouTube, hope your day is going well. Like the title says, today's video is going to be an H&M haul. I have not done one of these since like, I think summertime, maybe early fall, and I found some goodies for y'all, so I'm super excited to share, okay? Make sure you stay tuned to the end because you don't want to miss all the good good, okay? <laughs> if you're new here, my name is Chi Chi and we cover fashion, beauty, and a lifestyle on this channel. So if that's the kind of stuff you're into, if that's your jam, you are in the right place, okay? Get comfortable, get them snacks. Without further ado, <laughs> let's get into this video. So the first item I wanna share with you guys, can you see that I have a thing for ribs right now? <laughs> Rib knits right now? I just, I don't know. Something about this like 70s texture just really rubs me the right way. Um, it's going to be this purple midi dress. Oh my God, as soon as I saw the color, I was like, mm, that's mine. I need that. And then what really sold me on it was of course this cut out back. It's so good. Um, love the idea of pairing this with over the knee boots. You could also pair these with ankle boots. You could pair this with pumps as we go into the spring. And I love that this purple isn't too light, but it's not too dark either. I got this in an extra large, which is my true size. And I am so obsessed with these. I think this is gonna sell out. Hopefully it's not sold out by the time you see this because I did share this on Instagram um, with the girls. But yeah, it's just an easy um, midi skirt. And I would say for the weight of this, this is almost somewhere in between like a sweater dress and a regular dress, which is great as we go into spring. I feel like dresses like this are the workhorse of this season just because, you know, you can just throw it on and you're instantly put together, but you're also super comfortable. You know, that's another, that's what I love about pieces like this. Like it's not fussy. There's no, there's just no restriction. You can eat, you can lounge, you can lay on the couch and do your work. You can sit on a desk and do your work. You are looking Zoom ready without putting any effort at all. So love these. And of course that dress is perfect for date night with Bay. okay? The cutout detail is very sexy. Um, must have, if you only get one thing, get that, okay? <laughs> So the next couple of items I wanna share with you guys I've actually had for a little while. I don't know why I haven't like shared them. I've gotten a few questions about these when I've worn it on Instagram, so I figured I'd share them with you. The first item is going to be this turtleneck. H&M always does these turtlenecks every year. They are the perfect layering turtleneck. They're lightweight enough, but they're still substantial. They're really soft, and I would say for the price of these, the quality is pretty good. These turtlenecks are like $10, and if you catch like a 20% off sale, you're paying like $8 for them. So I'm gonna link them. I'm not sure if this print is still available, Available, but I'm gonna link it to it because they always have really good prints and I just love this color because it really pairs really well with my suede moto jacket and just other pieces that I have and if you're looking to like build like a capsule wardrobe or just just create a wardrobe that's a little bit more easy to navigate and put together outfits I always recommend going you know really building a wardrobe around neutrals but Neutrals don't have to be boring. You can totally spice up your neutrals with a print like this. It still adds fun and interest to your look while still fitting perfectly and seamlessly into that capsule wardrobe. So this next item I recently featured on Instagram and it is this bright pink fur coat. It's kind of like a watermelon color. I said a couple of videos ago that I've been really having fun with adding um, color to my winter wardrobe. And one thing that I was really lacking was like colored outerwear. So I've always, I've been on the hunt for like affordable yet chic colored outerwear. And when I saw this color, I knew she had to be mine. Okay, she just had to be mine. Like this is so soft, it's incredible. I don't know what they're making these fabrics out of, but literally you just wanna wrap yourself in it. And when it comes to weight, I would say it's more of like a medium 
I wouldn't call it a heavyweight, so more of like a medium weight. Love the oversized lapels. This, I would have loved if it was longer. Like if it was like a knee length coat, oh my God, it would have been so good. But regardless, it's still a really great jacket and I picked it up in a size extra large. And it has pockets like so and this is from their divided range. So that's like their more like teen range. Absolutely feel like this is great quality and worth the price. Now, when I checked on H&M, I couldn't find this color anymore. I think it was sold out, but they still have the same exact um, jacket in like a tan, not tan, like almost like a, almost like an off white color and black. So I will link to that for you guys down below. Now, continuing on, um, if you saw the this or that challenge that Alex and I did, one of the, on Instagram, one of the biggest questions I got was, where's that jacket from? It's from H&M, sis. I had to scour for these. I ended up grabbing these in store because they were sold out online. I'm wearing this in a size large, and it fits Fine. I would have still preferred extra large just so that the length would be a little bit longer, but it fits, it buttons, it has these really great pockets like so. And I will be sure to um, link other shackets. I found a very similar option to this one for you guys. Um, and H&M, like, they'll bring them, they, H&M has been bringing out these shackets like intermittently. I also definitely recommend you checking in store. Again, I'm typically an extra large true and true at H&M and I was able to size down to a large. So I would say that this does have a lot of room. So if you find a size that's slightly smaller than you, especially if you're in between sizes like me, don't worry about it. Go ahead and grab it. Um, but I'm going to link to any of the recent um, shackets that they've put brought in as well as um, the one that I found that was very similar. I'm just obsessed with the colorway. You guys know I live in my jeans. And so this really goes well with jeans, but I can also throw this on with leggings, which I have. I can throw this on with gray joggers. The colorway is really perfect for our wardrobe this season, especially if you're more in sweats and more casual and more jeans. Must have, must have. We'll definitely link the dupe I found for you guys. The next item I wanna share with you guys is this bright pink dress. It's like a baby doll style dress. This is also from the Divided range. And I got this to style with um, combat boots. I just love the juxtaposition between the combat boots and the really girly dress and this color, gorgeous. It also has like an oversized lapel. I'm not too much of a fan of this oversized lapel trend. That's why I always think it's a good idea to um, not spend so much on trends and just kinda, you know, dip, dabble in it, see if you love it, see if you wear it, and then if you will, then go ahead and splurge. And this dress was pretty affordable. I think it was like under 25, and I also got a discount on it. It's a like a cotton kind of fabric. I believe it's still available in limited sizes. And I got this in an extra large, and it fits me very well. It's in a cotton fabric, like I said, which means you can wear it now with like a chunky sweater or like a fur coat. Like I paired the fur coat and, and the um, dress together. And you can also wear it later as things start to cool off or start to warm up rather for spring and um, summer. Now you guys know that I can't see something mustard and not grab it for myself. So <laughs> I saw this mustard. Um, top, it has all the things that I love, puff sleeves, and it has a sweetheart neckline, very flattering for my pear-shaped girls. And then this eyelet detail is so good. And again, as I'm thinking forward into spring, I think this would be perfect, paired with white jeans and like a wrap sandal and a little straw tote. Um, this would also be perfect now, again, styled with jeans and some boots right now, like some cognac colored boots. So blue jeans, cognac colored boots, that's how I would style this now. And of course, a jacket of some sort. Love, love, love this. I actually have a mustard turtleneck, so if I wanted, um, I could layer this on top of the um, turtleneck 
just for extra warmth. So I love this and it was on sale too, which makes me think it's like a carryover from last summer. I will of course link it for you guys as well. And I got it in a size extra large for reference. So the next item I picked up, and this is the item that I'm just like, I need your help guys. I need your help on this one because I'm not sure if I love it or don't love it. I mean, abstractly, I love it, but I'm just not sure. And it's going to be these tall platform combat boots. I have been wanting some taller platform um, combat boots. I think what I'm not sold about is this um, lacing for some reason. I almost wish it was just a sleek one piece. And they actually did have a version of that, but it had a tan sole, which I wasn't that much of a fan of because I felt like I wouldn't get as much wear out of it. And also it sold out in my size. Um, but I saw this one that's all black. I love the fact that the lacing is all black. It's very, very sleek. Also that it has this zipper. So once you set up the laces, you don't have to worry about it. My only issue really with these boots is that it's a size 10 and y'all know I wear size 11. When I put it on, it did fit, but I don't know. Maybe it's cause you know, I just typically, if this was leather, I would have been okay with that because I know that after a while it would stretch. But when it comes to like faux leather things like this, very affordable things like this, I think this was like 35 or so. Um, I just feel like when you get the wrong size, they're uncomfortable and they never get comfortable. So that's why I'm just unsure of this. So I'm going to, you know, style it for you guys. And I would love for your opinion, whether you think she's a keeper or whether you think I should return her. I would totally style her with the purple midi dress as well if I was trying to dress it down. So, um, and then of course my midi skirts, my leggings, like endless options with these boots but I just don't know. So let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are on this boot. So when I am not on YouTube, you can always find me on Instagram. Come on over there, come say hey. If you have any pressing questions, any video requests, my DMs are always open. Um, if there's anything that I forgot to mention, sizing, fit, any of that in this video, definitely leave a comment and check the description box because I try to make it as thorough. If you want details on this lip, I'm rushing y'all because it's getting darker by the second. If you want details on this lip, if you want details on this top, any of that good stuff, make sure to check the description box down below. Let me know what to do with those boots. Are they a keeper? Are they a returner? I would love your input. So if you enjoyed this video and you want me to make more H&M hauls, make sure you hit that like button. Also subscribe for more awesome hauls, styling tips, and outfit ideas. Check out this video and this video. And until next time, stay blessed.